Okay folks, today we're going to be talking about the song Squeeze Box by The Who. This was a strange one for them, but uh, it's a lot of uh, uh, country style uh, three chord songs. So when we do this open G, like before, I'm going to play a little bit of the song and then I'll get into the explanation of how to play this great song. Mama's got a squeeze box that wears on the chest. Daddy gets home, he never gets no rest, cause he's playing all night. The music's alright. Pam's got a squeeze box, Daddy never sleeps at night. Kids don't eat and the dogs can't sleep. Don't escape from the music in the whole damn street. Cause she's playing all night And the music's alright Mama's got a squeeze box Dad and never sleeps at night Okay, let's go ahead and talk about how to play this great tune. As I stated before, this is an open G tuning. Basically, it's the song is in G and it starts out with just an open G sound. You're going to just be playing the first five strings. And then you're going to go to a chord called a C with a G bass. And that's essentially uh, putting your first finger on the first fret of the second string and then putting your uh, ring finger or your middle finger on the second fret of the fourth string. And, and you're going to use the, the fifth string as the bass. So it's... And then you're just basically going to be bouncing between this, this chord, the C with a B bass, and the, and the G chord. So it's... You just got to get that rhythm, the rockabilly rhythm. And you're just pounding. That's the beautiful thing about open G tuning. You can go to this suspended. This is essentially a G suspended fourth. Got a squeeze box she wears on the chest. Okay, second chord, the second line on this thing goes up to D, and you're basically going to do the same thing in D. You're just going to, uh, a D is made by putting your, your first finger on all the five strings on the seventh fret. That's a D, and then you're going to be going to the suspended fourth. So it's same little pattern. The suspended fourth is made by putting your middle finger on the eighth fret of the second string and your ring finger on the uh, ninth fret of the uh, fourth string. So it's. And then it's going to drop down to a C, which is on the fifth fret, putting your finger, first finger, all over the first five strings. So it's. You're going to do that same pattern. You're going to put your middle finger on the uh, sixth fret of the second string and your ring finger on the seventh fret of the fourth string. So what, you're going to get that suspended fourth again. Okay, so the, um, the verse goes like this. Uh, let me just go ahead and play that. And it's playing all night, D suspended fourth to D. Then you go into C, to C suspended fourth, and then back to D, D, and then D suspended fourth, back, and then G. And that's basically how you play the, the verses, and uh, pretty easy. Now, it slows down once you get to the, uh, to the sort of the interlude, the bridge, I guess you could say. She goes, and then just basically playing, she squeezes me, just an open G, come on and squeeze me, and then a D, tease me like you do, I'm so in love with you, see. And then it goes back into it, D. And that's, 
that's really the whole song. You can jazz it up however you want, but uh, this is a fun song in 4-4 timing, and it is just, <laughs> it's made for open G tuning, so. And I think that's how they played it.